Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math. And today we're going to learn about differentiation, and we're going to apply the product rule. We're going to differentiate each function with respect to x. So if I was given this function, f of x is equal to x squared times negative 3, x squared minus 2. Okay? Well, if I want to apply the product rule, I need to see that I have my function in two parts. This is f, first part, and this is g. Okay, f being x squared and g being negative three x squared minus two. Now to apply the product rule, because there's multiplication going on as a product rule, f prime of x, when I take my derivative, I have the first part, let's go apply it right here, keep my original function, uh, first part, f x squared times the derivative of the inside of this parenthesis here, so that's negative six x, right? Derivative of that, this power comes down, we apply the power rule there, negative 6x, and then derivative of negative 2, 0. So negative 6x there, plus, what's in the parentheses? Negative 3x squared minus 2, times the der uh, derivative of the first part, which is just, well, derivative of f is 2x, right? Because f was x squared. Now we've, at this point, we've taken the derivative. So now we need to simplify. So we have f prime of x here. Let's simplify that. Well, x squared times negative 6x is a negative 6x to the third, plus distribute this 2x across, 2x times negative uh, 3x squared is uh, negative 6x to the third, uh, 2 times negative 2 is a negative 4x. Let's combine our like terms, we have the same uh, exponent, same degree there, so we have, excuse me, f prime of x is equal to negative 6x to the third plus negative 6x to the third is negative 12x to the third minus 4x at the end, and there we have it. We have our derivative. f prime of x is equal to negative 12 x to the third minus 4x. So let's recap. We're given f of x is equal to x squared times, in parentheses, negative 3 x squared minus 2, in parentheses. Well, I, I notice that uh, I or write this to be x squared to be f, and the other part, negative 3 x squared minus 2, to be g. Well, then I the product, apply the product rule here, which is f times g prime plus g times f prime, right there. All right, so taking the derivative of f and g and put them in their corresponding spots, but same with just keeping f and g in their corresponding spots. Then I simplify. And in simplification, I notice we have negative six x to the third plus negative six x to the third minus four x, like terms there. So I combine them to give me my final answer, which is f prime of x is equal to negative 12 x to the third minus four.